everybody and welcome back to my YouTube channel. I hope you're having a lovely day. If you are new here, hello, my name is Scarlett and welcome to my channel. If you haven't yet subscribed, I would be ever so grateful if you were to consider subscribing and of course clicking the like button if you did enjoy this video. I'm going to start off today's video by apologising for the lack of Ringo content and if you are new here and you have no idea who Ringo is, Ringo is my horse. It just so happens to be that the last three videos, including today's, have been sit-down videos. And again, if you're new here, I post two videos a week on Thursdays and Saturdays at 4.30pm. So last Thursday's video was a QA. and a It's the first one I've done. Um, and I obviously thought it was quite important for you guys to learn a little bit more about myself and Ringo. Um, and then, of course, Saturday's video was a Halloween-inspired video. It was a sit-down video with my equestrian friend Tamsin, and we carved pumpkins equestrian style. Um, and obviously then today's video, which is going up on Thursday, today is Monday, and I was actually planning on going to the yard today. But it just so happens that today and tomorrow, Forest Oaks are closed. Well, they're not closed, but the arenas aren't able to be ridden in because they are being resurfaced. We can't ride today or tomorrow. So I was then kind of thinking mm, I'm away on Wednesday I've only then got a day to plan a video which I'm wanting to film Saturday's video on Thursday which is going to be Ringo <laughs> um, and so I came up with the idea of sharing with you guys my favorite equestrian brands so that of course is today's video this is not all of my equestrian attire as such and if you would like to see a full video of my complete collection of riding wear then please leave a comment down below but today's video is just my favorite brands and I've just chosen one outfit as such from each brand so it's not too just so today's video isn't too long and also guys a bit of an update before I begin trying on my favorite brands I have decided to take part in vlogmas this year and I'm going to be doing an equestrian style of vlogmas and to those of you who don't know what Vlogmas is, Vlogmas is basically posting a video a day in December for Christmas. But now I have every single day of December up until Christmas Eve, well including Christmas Eve, planned. And so long as everything goes to plan, there will be a video a day in December. Um, keeping to my keeping to my usual times of 4.30 a day, so whether you're coming back from work, coming back from the yard, or coming back from school, there will be a video waiting for you. The content and videos I have planned are so fun, they include so much Ringo, obviously everything is equestrian based as well, um, and I honestly cannot wait. The 5th of December, so the first Sunday in December, I have planned a huge video, which I'm hoping to film next week. Um, or begin filming. I think it's going to take a good few weeks of filming and editing. If it goes the way I want it to go, it is going to be epic. Um, so do keep an eye out on my YouTube channel for the 5th of December as well. And I promise you guys I'm going to start this video properly in literally two minutes, but I just wanted to share with you guys the most amazing package I received today and this little section of this video has kindly been sponsored by this company. The company is called Rose Forever New York. So this arrived this morning it has come all the way from New York. It is still perfectly packaged and intact. It smells to die for. These are basically preserved roses, so they are real roses, not plastic or fake roses. And, and these roses will live and last for at least a year. So if you were looking this year to buy somebody a very special gift, somebody that loves flowers, somebody like myself who is the biggest fan of white roses, and there's nothing more upsetting I feel like when you buy yourself or you get bought a beautiful bunch of flowers and they begin to die, you know, more quickly than what you'd hope. Um, these are going to last, as I say, up until next Christmas if you were to buy them now. They come in all shapes and sizes and all colours as well. I have personally chosen the white dome, but they also come in velvet cases, pinks, blacks, reds, blues, whatever. Whichever colour you fancy or you love the most or your friend or partner or loved one loves the most, they cater for every colour, every style and every design. And I am so grateful to Rose Forever. I absolutely love these. They are going to be the centrepiece on my dining table 
for the next year and I cannot thank you guys enough so thank you very much and if I can't remember if I have said already or not but if you are looking to shop anything like this I will leave the link in the description box down below for you. Okay guys so starting off with the base layer set that I'm currently wearing from the lovely brand called Grey Equestrian. Again all links will be in the description box down below. So Grey Equestrian have very kindly sent me this beautiful khaki base layer set. I'm fully obsessed. It arrived yesterday and to say that I cannot wait to wear it on Ringo is an understatement. I'm obsessed with this colour at the moment. Anything khaki to forest green I'm finding it so autumnal. I find it such a flat colour and it suits all hair colours and it's a very versatile colour in my opinion. The quality of the set is wonderful. Now I must admit this is the first time I have worn anything from this brand but I was not even slightly disappointed. So in terms of branding we have Grey Equestrian written here on the sleeve and there's the GE sign here on the chest as well. Pretty sure that arm is left plain. Now we've also got if you can imagine, I can't really describe how the material is, but on leggings or breeches, they usually have the sticky full leg or sticky knees, if that makes sense. So on the waistline here, we also have that kind of, not necessarily like sticky material, but do you know what I mean? You know, what's it called? Like a... Um, Oh, goodness me. Anyway, whatever it is, we have it here on the panels along the waist as well. Now, moving on to the leggings. And you can't really see me too well, which is really annoying. Let me see if I can jump on the chair without breaking myself or the chair. So... Hi. We have the most amazing sized foam pocket here. Like my arm pretty much, I mean, it doesn't go the whole way down, but you know, I get a, a good majority of my hand that's going to fit the biggest sized iPhone, car keys if you need car keys in there, etc, etc. It's going to fit a lot in and it's quite uncomfortable up there. I'm probably not the best to be trying to break my furniture for a YouTube video. But, but these leggings also offer a full sticky seat. So from here, all the way down to your knees is sticky. One thing that I definitely look for a lot of the time when buying leggings and breeches is that they offer the sticky knees, bumps, etc. I feel like it offers so much more support in the saddle. You're a lot more, as I say, supported and... I just feel like function. I just feel like functioning wise, when you have that extra bit of support, it makes all the difference. And I'm pretty sure there's also some branding here as well. I can't see that. And if I'm to show you the details of the top up close, we have such a lovely zip here as well. You can see the actual detail in the zip, but it is so lovely. And whether done up or undone, it's not too tight here. There's nothing worse than having base layers that are too tight and almost feel like they're strangling and almost feel like they're strangling you up here. So I fully, fully approve of this base layer. And as I say, this is now one of my favourite equestrian brands since trying this base layer set. Another one of my favourite brands, of course, is Holland Cooper. Now, this set is one of their newest base layer sets out, and it's actually the most recent one that they have very kindly sent me. I have worked with Holland Cooper a few times now, and to say every single time is a pinch me moment is goes beyond words. I'm just forever honoured to work with the amazing brands I do, and Holland Cooper has always been one of my favourite brands. So this base, so like with all Holland Cooper, the quality is always perfection. I feel like with Holland Cooper, they make equestrian clothing very high end and very very glamorous, very uh, like very statement. Like they, they, they offer very statement pieces. And I really like that. I, feel, I love how equestrian fashion has recently evolved so much and there's so many more color options now to basic jodhpurs and t-shirts and polo shirts. You know, you now have beautiful glamorous outfits and matching outfits and mismatching outfits that we can all go and buy and collect. And I love that. I feel like putting a little bit of glamour into equestrian into the equestrian world just makes it makes it more fun it makes that extra bit of difference and you know it's I love it I, I love going upstairs to get ready to go and ride Ringo and think oh what, what should I wear today what? so moving on to to cut so much out of me absolutely blabbing and it got to the point that I was blabbing so much I was thinking 
where am I going with this? So back to the point, this base layer set, as I was saying, with all Holland Cooper, it is the most pristine quality ever. So we'll start off with the top. So detail wise, we have branding here, the gorgeous gold hardware zips, which they usually have with everything as well. Again, not too tight here. I'm not feeling strangled or uh, what's the word? like claustrophobic, sometimes they make me feel a bit claustrophobic if they're too tight up here. We have branding down both arms in this gorgeous side panel, gold writing, white panels, absolutely beautiful. Now going on to the leggings, oh, I may have to get back on the chair. <laughs> so, <laughs> I didn't think I was going to be doing this today. I need to figure out somehow where I can make it better for trying on things. So we have the matching panel going down this leg, which obviously matches the arm. These are so flattering. The phone pocket has its own flap as well. So your phone is very much protected in here. You pop your phone into the pocket of which there's some more branding on here as well. Um, and then you pop the flap over your phone and your phone is not going anywhere. I love how secure these pockets are. And, <laughs> This is the full view from the front, including a gold hardware button here as well, which is, I think, pretty much on all of their leggings sets. Of course, Holland Cooper don't only offer beautiful base layer sets and breeches, they also offer the most amazing equestrian outwear. So, I also have this jacket in their iced pink, and I'm pretty sure it's called the Hybrid Puffer. So, from the front, with the puffer, here, it almost looks like a, a gilet. You have the, the fleecy lined sleeves as well, obviously making it the hybrid. So it's kind of a bit of a mixture between a jumper and a gilet. I think these are beautiful. I love the baby pink as well. We obviously have pockets. I feel like this is so glamorous, but just being black is a much more practical color when dealing with the dirty horses. For example, Ringo. <laughs> so this is the puffer more up close. So we have Branding here, going down the inner lining of the zip as well, and a gold zip as per most Holland Cooper. This arm here is plain, and this arm all the way down <laughs> is embossed with the logo for Holland Cooper and obviously branding, etc. etc. So let me do the jacket up so you guys can see it also done up. And as always with Holland Cooper, nothing is forgotten. Look how beautiful even the zips are. I feel like ugh, this brand just, it just does it right, doesn't it? Um, and I'm just fully, fully obsessed. And so I moving on to potentially my favorite base layer set ever. I mean, dare I say it, but I do think it is my favorite. Everything here from the quality to the price point, to the wearability, to the functionality, to how flattering it is on the body, to just the comfort, everything about this base layer, and it's still glamorous, is just incredible. Now this is from the Team Aubrey and Range from Shires, and and the first time I tried this on, I just remember, I, the first time I tried it on, I was actually on a photo shoot taking photos for Shires, and I just remember in my head thinking, I cannot wait to ride in this. I have since worn it riding, and I can confirm, well, it's, it's my favourite. So the quality of the top, but the comfort of the top. You know sometimes how base layers are cold when you first put them on, because they're, they're, they're that more shiny material? This isn't, so let me come up close. It's almost like a brushed, not a brushed fabric, but a softly, slightly brushed fabric. So it's so comfortable and soft on the body and it's warm from the second you put it on. Is this gold? A gold hardware zip, obviously fully functioning as well. Gold branding here from Shires too. And this arm has the Aubrian logo panel down the arm too. So, let me once again get on the chair. <laughs> the best part about these leggings, and I did forget to say as well with the Holland Cooper, they also have the sticky knees, bums, etc. However, I feel like this set is taking a sticky bum to the next extreme. And the quality, when I rode, I did not move from the saddle in these. I'm just, I really seriously, the second, as I say, the second I put this set on, I fell in love with it. I love riding in navy as well, and try, trying to turn around without falling, hanging onto my curtains. 
We also have the Aubrian logo down this side of the leg and a very decent sized phone pocket once again. This is actually lined as well, which I think will add extra security to your phone and not sliding out. Coming back down for safety. <laughs> so with the base layer, let me try and get on my tippy toes. There is a pocket in here. So if you are out hacking and you want to keep your keys safe, but always access to your phone from your phone pocket, your keys will fit into this pocket perfectly. So moving on to the next brand, which I feel like a lot of people will agree with me because how I would describe this next company or brand is the center of rider and horse fashion. And that of course goes without saying that this brand is Lemieux. So, so I'm gonna start off with the base layer that I'm wearing because I'm actually wearing breeches underneath here. So this is the Liberty base layer in the color Rioja. We have, we have a silver hardware zip here, which obviously is beautiful, stitching paneling, stitching panels here as well. Again, it just makes this whole look here a lot more structured and put together. If anybody has watched any of my previous videos, you're all going to know how obsessed I am with Rioja. And if you watched my Lemire unboxing, it obviously, it, <laughs> you would have noticed how long it took me to learn to pronounce Rioja. Not Rioja, not Rioja, not something else that I think I pronounced it as. It is in fact Rioja, and if you don't know what Rioja is, which I didn't, it's a red wine. I'm not really a big drinker, and I had no idea what Rioja was. <laughs> so I am obsessed with this colour. Ringo has the full matching outfit. I've also got the fleece to this. I've got the hoodie. I pretty much own everything now in Rioja because I'm obsessed. Now, how I would describe the Liberty base layers is definitely more of a thermal styled base layer. So these are going to keep you a lot warmer in the winter. They're slightly thicker to any of the other base layers that I own. Again, some to the shires but it's slightly thicker this is that lovely soft brushed material so when you put it on it is a warm material as opposed to being cold and shiny um very very flattering very lovely to ride in as i say it's maybe not the kind of base layer that you'd wear in the heat of the summer because it is that bit thicker and warmer but in the winter autumn winter these liberty base layers will be your best friends and now me, and now me back on the chair, moving on to the breeches. Now these are my favorite breeches I have ever tried. And these are the Lemur Dynamique ones. Carefully turning around. They have the Diamante, are they working pockets or are they fake pockets? You know, I've never actually had a look. I mean, they're kind of working. You'd fit a pair of keys in there, I think. <laughs> so you have Diamante pocket covers up here, which is obviously what I love about them because I am, very much obsessed with Diamante and Glamour. I love this here on the bottom by the ankle. It's almost like a sock material, so it's really, really comfy, um, but also very supportive and like non-blister giving, if that makes sense. Like it gives you the extra support, always gives you like an extra layer of sock for protection down here. And of course it has the full grip, knees, bums, etc. <laughs> All of that jazz. I know all of that jazz. So I am the biggest fan of Lemire. They are probably, well, I say they're probably my favorite brand. These are all my favorite brands, hence the video. So I can't really say that because every brand I'm like, oh, this is my favorite brand, this is my favorite brand. They're all my favorites, otherwise they wouldn't be in this video. But in terms of a horse and rider, they cater for everything, don't they? So, and I love so if you guys follow me on Instagram, I'm out of breath from trying on lots of clothes, but if you follow me on Instagram, you will see me posting pictures in this brand a lot of the time. And this brand is called Equa L Equestrian, and they really do bring the glamour to the equestrian fashion world. So, I was very lucky to receive a humongous PR package the other day from Equa L, but this is the colour combo I have decided to go for today. Obviously choosing pink. Now I'm a very pink person. When I see the most beautiful coloured pink in a riding top with gold hardware, I am sold. So the quality of these really, really, really are insane and it speaks for itself. So we have a gold hardware zip here. Again there's room it's so lovely to have room i don't want anything like a stock <laughs> on my neck i love having room gold branding here on the chest this gorgeous gold hardware here on the sleeves the hardware on the sleeves is actually one of my favorite parts of the branding in this brand if that makes sense i just find it so glamorous and it just adds that extra touch of glamour and i'm wearing the black leggings 
And so with the top of the leggings, we have an uh, we have a lovely elastic waistband, branding at the front and at the back of these leggings along the waistband, the same on the back as what is on the front here. And we have the branding going down the leg, and again the extra hardware here, which, as I say, you put a heart around it because I love it. And the last of my favourite brands that I have chosen for this video is definitely not least, and that is Blackheart Equestrian. So this whole outfit actually only arrived yesterday, so it's the first time I've properly tried it on. I bought it myself after seeing Ellie wearing their new breeches, so I'm really excited to show you guys those in a second when I risk my life back up on the chair. But I thought I would go through their base layers first. So this is in the colour stone, and as I say, this is a new colour, new colour for me. It's literally arrived yesterday. I've literally just cut the tags out of them. So the colour stone is kind of like a a creamy greyish colour. Like it's it's like a like an ashy cream, if that makes sense. Well, like the colour of stone. I love the zips on these, they're so easy to do up and do down. Again, a lovely material where it's not cold to put on, it's a very buttery soft skin fitting, like it, it kind of just like moulds itself to your skin, um, the quality, the, the material of this kind of just moulds itself to your skin which gives it that very buttery lovely feeling. I love the fact that on their zips they also include this, now this doubles up as a hair tie for myself and sometimes for Ringo if I'm out of elastic bands. If you'd watched my channel before you would know that if Ringo isn't plaited into his bridle, i.e. taking let me stand back a bit for this. <laughs> if I don't take a little bit of his forelock out and plait it into his mane over the top of his bridle, he's very clever and knows that one shake of the head, the bridle comes off. So if I'm riding around and I've forgotten to tie him in, or if I've run out of elastic bands, I always, and I'm wearing a black heart top, I will always take this off and plait that into his mane as well. There's some very understated branding on the arms as well. And they have the same on the back as well. I think when it comes to base layers, Blackheart really do do it very well. The quality is amazing. I feel the price point for the quality you get, I think they're £40 each, which for the quality that you get in these base layers, the colour the color choices you get as well, and as I say, the quality, it is incredible. Thumb holes too. They are, I think, probably my these definitely are one of my favourite base layer brands. Um, I'm obsessed. And I now have to share with you guys the most incredible breeches as well. They're called a hybrid breech. So they kind of, they feel like you're wearing leggings. So when I say that they're comfortable, oh my goodness, but they give the same support as a breech. So, let me get back up here. <laughs> the first thing I'm gonna share with you, not that I'm straight yet, is the size of these pockets. My arm, well, I've got my elbow <laughs> to my fingertips in the pocket. It runs the whole way down both sides. So storage wise, <laughs> we have a lot. I love the fact that there's belt loops as well. I feel like having a glamorous belt on when you ride is a lovely extra statement. Um, and a lot of leggings, obviously, because leggings don't need the belt loops. They don't offer that. So I love the fact that this obviously does. <laughs> logo wise we have the logo here in a reflective um reflective whatever the word is i'm looking for um <laughs> we have faux pockets here but again i feel like that's a really nice added detail and i find it's actually really really flattering too and of course we have a full sticky leg at the hole and of course we have the full grip here the whole way down to literally here so even if you're wearing short boots you've still got You've still got grip all the way down to here. A lot of brands start here, or are just here, or just on the full grip. This literally offers a full support of the whole leg, and of course that goes right, and of course that goes all the way around the back as well. This is the colour. I want to say they're burgundy, but I feel like they've got a different name. Maybe they're plum, or they're maybe they're burgundy. I don't know, but it's this colour, <laughs> basically, if that helps. And yeah. As always a black heart, I am fully obsessed. I also feel like I've said the words fully obsessed a lot in this video. 
and quality and comfort and <laughs> I've said a lot of words a few times. <laughs> so guys, that concludes today's video. I really hope you enjoy it. As I said at the beginning, if you would like to see a full video on my complete collection of riding clothes, every brand, every set that I own, etc, etc, it would be a long one, but if you would like me to do it, leave that in the comments section down below and if you'd like it to be a try on or just a talk through of each brand that I have and own. If you haven't yet subscribed, I would be ever so grateful if you were to consider it and of course clicking the like button if you did enjoy this video. Size guides and things like that, I would say that all of these brands that I've tried on for you guys today are very true to size. I really hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you tune in to my next one. Have a great day.